Hello and welcome to Takeoff Aviation Weather. We're going to spend a minute to show you how to get started with Takeoff. The first thing Takeoff will ask for is permission for your location. We will use this to find airports nearby you. When the reports load, you will see that they are color-coded green, yellow, and red. A green airport represents an airport within your personal minimums. A yellow airport represents a warning, meaning you're close to your personal minimums. A red title indicates that one of your minimums has been exceeded. You'll see four icons for each airport. They represent the ceiling, visibility, total winds, and crosswinds. If you slide over or press the top left button, you'll see the takeoff menu, which provides access to the four primary ways to find airports. Additionally, the settings screen shows you how to set your minimums. You'll see you can set your ceiling, visibility, total winds, and crosswinds. Here, we are going to apply a very conservative set of minimums to show how takeoff works. You'll see here we set our winds very low. We will then slide over and select near me. This will force the reports to load using our new minimums. As the reports load, you will see a couple of airports have turned red, indicating they exceed our personal minimums. In this case, the visibility is below our minimum value. As we select another airport, you'll see that the total winds have exceeded our maximum. As we select yet another, you'll see the total winds have also exceeded the maximum and the crosswinds are at a warning level. Check out our other videos to learn more about takeoff aviation weather and get it from the Apple App Store for your iPhone and iPad and the Google Play Market for your Android phone or tablet.